uh, fish tank controller with an Arduino Mega and Ethernet controller. And here's one of my tanks. I don't have a servo on it yet. But my other tank is over here. And it has a servo on it. They both have temperature sensors in them, and then I got a temperature sensor in the room. Come over here. This is the tank, and on the back of my desk is the actual controller, which I got the panel on, so you can't really see it. But it's there. That's a picture of the controller with the panel open and a website that tracks the data. Let's see. There we go. So I can actually view the current data when the last feeding was, when the lights turned on or off, which would be start of day, end of day. Uh, tells me you know, if the tank lights are on, temperatures, except all that good stuff, and have a photo sensor in the window to detect the brightness outside. And I also set it up to where if I want, I can feed them at any given time just by clicking this. Now, it's set up to check every 60 seconds. So, it may take a little bit before that does the feeding. But as you can see here, it shows feed fish, current feed status, true. Even shows when the most recent feeding was, which was 8.40 this morning. I've been kind of playing around with it all day. Oh, no. I thought I was going to do something. So we'll just enjoy the fish. Oh, there it goes. And beeps to let me know when it starts and finishes. And uh, as you can see, the current feed status is now false. And it is 8.41 a.m. And most recent feeding was 8.41 a.m. Pretty neat little feature. Um, what it does is uh, I set it up to post to my SQL server on my local web server. Um, anytime it does anything and it also checks it every 60 seconds uh, to see what the current temperatures are so you got room temp and tank temperature on both tanks uh, I also created a blog post that uh, goes into more detail with everything. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, I'll post the link uh, down below and you can go to my blog and ask anything you want. Thanks for viewing.